Today was a usual day of registration and measurement and all the things that people do uh, the day before racing. But there was a little bit more happening today. We organize uh, sub racing with a big one design, the wing 126 12, uh, with a uh, 30, 40 kids this morning. And we also have a, uh, another open big uh, monthly race. So we have a lot of uh, option to go on the water. From let's say seven years, seven years uh, boy to the 74 years uh, old lady enjoy uh, uh, water sports with uh, big equipment. Techno is a, is a big uh, international class, mm -hmm. but uh, in Japan you are especially successful with Techno Plus. How is it possible that the biggest fleet of uh, Techno Plus you have in Japan? Okay, in Japan since year 2010. Uh, biggest fleet uh, called JUBF, which is a university student windsurfing club. So they uh, decided to go with uh, Techno 293. The number of the player is growing, growing every year. Then uh, now uh, the OB, old boy and old girl, uh, want to continue windsurfing activity with the Techno class. So this is happening in Japan. Firstly, uh, our pricing is uh, really let's say, good, affordable price. So uh, people easy to join these sports. So this is the number one reason. And the board itself, Techno 293, is really easy to ride for everybody. So this is another good reason, I think. Then uh, after, let's say, four years serious windsurfing training in the university, they can choose 8.5 league easily. So let's say this is really good. Okay. Thank everybody here, the organisers, the sponsors, the city and of course the competitors. We hope you enjoy a very good regatta here. As you all know this could be the venue where in 2020 the Olympics will be, so a great experience for you all and for us as organisers and her administrators as well. So enjoy the regatta and good luck. Thank <laughs> you.